New safety technology on a lot of people's iPhones is creating an unexpected challenge for first responders. It turns out the feature alerts 911 if you're involved in a crash, but as our Jenny Runovich found out, it's also leading to false positives. Emergency runs with no emergency. Yeah, we're talking two false alarms in two days here in Johnson County. Police, fire, EMS get a call for an accident, only to find no crash, just an iPhone in the middle of the road. The owner of this iPhone was in a severe car crash and is not responding to their phone. That was the 911 message Johnson County dispatchers got twice last week. An automated distress call sent by someone's iPhone through a newer feature called crash detection. With Apple, it's only on the latest generation iPhone 14. If the phone detects you've been in a crash, it calls 911 on your behalf. Problem is, those two messages last week weren't crashes at all. The phones, likely left on someone's car, fell off onto the ground, so the iPhone mistakenly thought there was an accident, falsely triggering a full call out of first responders. We've dealt with OnStar crashes for a long time, uh, activating 911, so this is just another tool in the toolbox uh, to keep people safe. But it also comes with some challenges for us when we're responding with multiple pieces of apparatus from police, fire, and EMS, and we show up and we're going, there's no one here, but then it's the iPhone. You know,